bam 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 hi <laughs> hello 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 hi <laughs> uh welcome welcome today we're gonna play bear and breakfast i am so excited <laughs> I've been waiting for this game for a, a while. I don't know. I found it um, before before it was like announced that on like a you know the indie game uh, stream. I found this before. I swear. I I found it before anybody knew about it. Okay, I'm cool. <laughs> but I've been waiting for it to come out for a while, so I'm very excited. Hi 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 London Underground isn't that a isn't that a band maybe cool name uh hi Demon Taker hello um yeah this game I I found it and I love it already uh but I I did try to like not see any spoilers as in like I did I tried to just avoid much about it because um i just i just was like i like it automatically when i first saw it i was like yep i like that and then i didn't want to see anything else about it you know i just want to play it <laughs> i look at a game for two seconds and i'm like yeah that's a game i'll like or i'll go nope i don't like that game <laughs> gonna use this stream to see if i want to buy it or not mm -hmm. yes good idea Okay, so this is one of those games that uh, when you click off of it, the sound disappears. So that's why there's no sound anymore. Ready? I'm gonna click on it. Okay? Okay. Ready for a sound. There we go. <laughs> okay. Start game. Empty. Check. Oh. Okay. I love the art in this game! Uh, why can't I fall asleep on time? Oh, press space. I'm gonna be so tired tomorrow. Mom's gonna kill me. Ugh, mom's gonna kill me! Uh, <laughs> what? Hank's hands got very cold all of a sudden. Is Hank gonna die? He... He... He forehead? <laughs> His forehead felt heavy with a crushing pressure. That doesn't sound good. A dark figure with glowing eyes stared from far away. Weathered stones and dry wood surrounded it. <laughs> Suddenly, a blinding jolt of lightning illuminated the sky. Thunder cracked. A shriek pierced through the sky. <laughs> there was no one there. Oh no. What? Hank, what are you doing outside? What the hell? Everything felt dark and silent again, except for the rain. I forget why I said anything. Sleep is overrated. Well, that was weird. Ah! Can I move? No? Oh. Hello? Hello? I'm just a widow bear. I can't move! You're right! Do not. Is this spooky? Is this a scary game? Wait, hold on. <laughs> Don't see what? See? Uh, I didn't read that. Move. Don't move. Can't do that either. Tell me why was your was. I'm pressing was. Oh, okay. Wee! with a wheel man. Drip, drop, drip, drip, drip. Find. Oh. You mean like. An introspection thing? I found a bed. Sleep. How do I sleep? Take a nap in the death of bed. <laughs> I was not expecting this game to start like this, I'll be honest. Okay. E e e Sleepy time. Don't. You're not great at making up your mind. Wake. Don't wake up. Uh... Oh! That's it. No more dumplings before bed. But dumplings before bed are awesome. For the third time, Hank! Ma! 
Uh oh, better see what top. That's how bears talk. They go, uh oh, better see what top. Oh, bother. Can I play a little song? No. How do I weave? <laughs> it's just a cave? We live in a dank cave and I just have like a room. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> okay. Can I do anything in this dank cave? What's this? Character. That's me, Hank. Wow, okay, there's a lot here. All right. I'm not gonna worry about it. Ma! Whoa, okay. Never mind, there's another room. Is where my mom hang out? Oh, we got a whole thing going on. Hello. I'm up, I'm up. Well, aren't you a bag of bones? The bag of bones. Good to see how hibernation hasn't kicked in yet. <laughs> you get called down every time get extra sleepy. Besides... Besides what? I had a hard time sleeping. Too many thoughts. He looks like head empty. <laughs> well, that runs in the family. Have you tried thinking less? Gee, thanks, Ma. No, I'm... Where's Annie? Oh. In a room with Will, probably. I should go wake him. All right, honey. All right, honey bunny. Okay, bye, mom. The basics. You can move. You can move, move. Wait, I wasn't reading. Whoa! You can zoom in and out. Look at that. Look at that little bear butt. <laughs> okay, interact with different things. <laughs> can you guys see that? Hold on, wait. Yeah, you guys can see that. Okay. <laughs> the game uses an autosave feature. Okay. You can access game settings. Uh, okay. I understand. Can I interact with anything else? Wait, turn it on. Okay. <laughs> Thinking. Okay, Ma, I'll go wake up whoever the heck. Oh, what is that? Is that a little man? Is that a little bug man? Good! Get out! Oh my god, it's a little like bird. <laughs> Pigeon! Get out! Are they dating? That's weird. Anyways, get out! <laughs> I love the way he looks. Okay, this art and everything is... I love it so much. Looking at this and this whole game, like, it makes me want to make a game, even though that is impossible, but... I love it! Out. That's not very good morning of you. <laughs> There's nothing good about being up this early. Mm, I don't smell any reason to be up yet. What do you mean? I can smell him a mile away. Delightful, both of you. <laughs> What's on the docket today, boss? Digging a new hole next to the other holes? Actually, Mom said she might let us cross the creek today and check under the bushes for mushrooms. what I tell ya? <laughs> I live for the hunt. How come we never get to do fun stuff anymore? Like a good old visit to the dumpster! <laughs> We're not allowed to pet the fence anymore. Besides, there hasn't been any new garbage in months. <laughs> well, we won't find any garbage or shroomies in... Sh sh shrooms? Here, let's go already. You're on his side now? <laughs> it's morning. We're up. Let's do stuff. They warn, they warn me betrayal never comes from your enemies. I like them. I like these kooky characters. <laughs> My mom. Hank, kids, over here. 
Mom, what are you doing? <laughs> is this the witchcraft? What is happening? Mom, are you summoning demons again? Adventure mode. In adventure mode, you can walk around, interact with things, and pick up items in your inventory. Uh, your inventory is access to the adventure mode menu. It holds every item you find in the world. You can use filters or the organization button. Oh, nice. Organization button. I like that. Or throw away whatever you don't need. Using the... The mini-map displays your current location day and allows you to navigate the world. Okay. I don't know how to... Oh, this? Oh. It's really tiny. Okay. I can't see. My eyeballs don't work. I'm concerned about this, Mom. This looks, um... Messed up. Okay. Hey, Ma! Morning, kid. <laughs> Morning, Miss M. I am. But... Lady, <laughs> did you sleep all right? Good as ever. Oh, good enough. Whatever that means. Good. Today is a very special day. I need you to go on the hunt. All right, point me to the hole. Two black moths. What? What? I know I said no going past the fence, but you've all been so good, and I need your help. <laughs> the bush around the tombstone is getting a little thick, and the flowers aren't in bloom anymore. So I'll need you to find me a bundle of alligator weed. I can't believe we get to leave this stinking place. <laughs> I mean, uh, adventure. Adventure. Anyway, Hank. You're in charge of this operation. Here's what I'm come looking for. In fact, take the whole notebook if you don't need to show you don't forget. Yay, notebook. But don't lose it again. He no, won't. We will. He will. Alright, you three. And remember, you're getting that bundle and straight back. Not one step further than the swamp. Hey, okay, ma'am. Okay. You just got a notebook. Collectibles. Uh, they give you various perks. Mad hi! You can find your current unlocked collectible in the character screen. Okay. How do I look up my... There it is. I got a notebook. Okay. Um, but where... Oh, this way? Oh, there's an arrow on the little map and stuff. Okay. <laughs> I can't wait to have my old bear and breakfast. <laughs> ah, cute! The three friends found themselves farther than they'd ever gone before. Past the soothing meadows and the quiet streams of the thicket. Margaret would know, but this was not exactly their first adventure. Annie, the Kyrian dog. I don't know what that word is. Brave, but clumsy. Will, the poor Will. Grumpy on the outside, but surprisingly... Even more uh, so on the inside. <laughs> and Hank, the brown bear. Cheerful and curious. Maybe a little concerned about the promise he made back home. No, Mom, I definitely would not wander too far in adventurous fashion. I promise. Uh-oh. He's like a little kid. Alright. Oh, wait. Alright, gang. Spur... Spur it out! Okay. It's kind of creepy, though. I guess I'll go over here. What's this? Uh... Screech! What in the what? I heard it too. Well, we better go. But I haven't found a thing for your mom yet. <laughs> Her eyeballs. I'm with Hank. Let's see where the sound came from. That's not what I meant. We're going back. You, 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 you know what? I put up some brand new car 
have a truck. Don't care. Mom said stay back. Let's go. She also said to get some gator weed. We haven't found any yet. Maybe there's some in the truck. No, come back. <laughs> okay. What is this? What is it? What is that? What is that? Yeah, that's one big rock. Now that's a big rock. Okay. Beep boop boop bub bub. What's that? Timber crossing? Okay. Oh! What is that? <laughs> okay. Is that a shark man? What am I looking at? Okay, looks like I can upgrade this house. Okay, well, uh, spoilers. I just got some trash. Ooh. Crafting table. Give me that. Take it all. Oh my god. Um, bah, 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 bah. I can't get ahead of myself. But also, give me this stuff. Let me go in. Take it all. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme bell grains. Oh. Now this is gaming. <laughs> My favorite thing to do in a game is press a button and collect the, the thing. Isn't that nice? Oh, I already have stuff. Okay. Uh -huh. Oh, those are windows! I was like, what is that? Okay. Hello! Shark man? Shark man? Is that a man? Nothing to lose, nothing to gain. Grab opportunity by the throat and show him who's boss. Um... The strange shark had a shiny, bouncy exterior and wore cool sunglasses. A little gray speaker box was strapped to his neck. Bl blurting out nonsense. It reminded Hank of Will's TV. Next to it, a little car had a big advert for something called Pawn Voyage. Nothing weird about it at all. Nothing to lose, nothing to gain. Grab it and shoot it by the throat. Then show it to his boss. Hello. Be part of the next exciting experience. Enticing, escaping, electrifying enterprise. Is, is someone there? You, they're a fine g gentleman in the orange coat. I am pretty gentle. How would you like to own the next me minor share in the next major maneuver? Well, I'm not into anything major, but I do like showing. <laughs> and I must read. Reiterate, the share is very minor. What do I get to sh what, what do we get to share again? Very, very minor. How exactly are you talking? Bon voyage is a multinational, multi layered, multi your friend corporation. What the <laughs> offering secure touristy. Adjacent goods and services in exchange for valuable personal collateral. You lost me. I don't think he ever had me to begin with. Just bring in your old, useless, priceless family jewelry or expensive heirloom of your choice and we'll give you... A three, one to three day, all-inclusive void voucher for the vacation of a lifetime. Sorry, bud. I don't have anything expensive or a heirloom. <laughs> Pawn Voyage is also the lookout for brand new, adventurous, and locations. Why does he keep saying it like that? For its millions of customers all around the valley. We may take any location or premises. No matter how run down or decrepit. To offer our very human patrons the holidays they deserve. Wait, for humans to live here? 
Uh, I don't think anyone wants to live here. They're just tourists. I've seen this before. The humans wander around where Shark Boy tells it. Then they stare at the trees. And try to forget whatever they were running from. I read it in a magazine. Humans are whack. For you, or a friend of a friend who would like to offer you your home or house to become a Pawn Voyage Premium Premises. By restoring, repairing, redecorating, and bringing it to a minimum standard which frankly no one enforces. And drastically, barely, alter your monthly income. Simply by pressing the green button under my gullet and a representative will get in touch. Uh, with <laughs> Bear, I don't even understand what he's saying either. I think he's selling uh Airbnbs. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I think that's I think that's what's going on here. I'm gonna be honest. I have no idea what he just said. If I heard right, that shark. Uh, I gotta lose his voice. If I heard right, that shark. If I heard that shark right, I'm pretty sure it wants to give us money. Human grade, primo quality, shiny money. <laughs> All I heard was that human are, humans are coming back. Well, the money has to get here somehow. Humans? Uh, I've barely seen one in months. <laughs> and that's more than enough. Oh, wow! Don't you see what this means? With your oddly alarming strength, my uh, foolproof understanding of all things, and spoil sport cheerful attitude. I am cheerful. I just don't care for him. That's all. We stand to make a boatload of cash. I'm gonna be honest. I have no idea what you just said. <laughs> Human back. Money give good. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> Is anything other than good? Look, just go tell the shark we're in. We'll just use any broken down shed. They're all abandoned anyways. Okay, visibility. Within the venture mode menu, you have two additional options. If you're not a fan of the dark, after midnight, you can sleep until the following morning. This also advances time. Leon, hi! What's today's game? We're playing Bear and Breakfast! We're still in sort of the tutorial phase, but... Yeah. We have our own little Airbnb and we're a bear. It's pretty good. If you'd like to see inside of most buildings, you can lower the roof and walls. Oh, like The Sims! Nice. You know, when I play The Sims, I haven't played in a long time, but every time I play The Sims, I just play the interior build in the house for hours. I use cheats, and I give myself a bunch of money, and then I just build a house. <laughs> Maybe that would be a fun stream. Build a really weird house. Survive a bear simulator? Uh, it's more like you're a bear, and you have um, an Airbnb. Mm, yeah. I don't really know. <laughs> Nothing to lose, nothing to gain. Grab opportunity by the throat and show it who's boss. Press the green button. A wall again. Congratulations! You have been automatically entered into a standard legal binding agreement. By using your fingerprint identification data from the local poli bl 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 police department. Welcome to the family er unknown error pattern. Uh, the name suits you. That was a weird voice. <laughs> you are now contractually obligated to provide your premium property details within the next three business days. Simply press the green button under my gullet when the premises are ready to accept our first guest. Uh, alright. Who knows anything about human houses? Well, I used to look at the pictures of the houses in the magazine we found. Could the humans maybe just live under a bus? No, I don't think that cuts it. They're fragile and get scared easily. <laughs> Sounds familiar. I think I know a thing or two about making a place cozy. And I do not get scared easily. Uh, yeah. 
<laughs> but I think we need help too. We should go find Tony. E. This shark is a federal agent. Uh, I really don't think we should bother him. Eh, he won't mind. Besides, I think he'll enjoy the company. I don't even know where he is these days. Uh, it's hard to get into his... It's hard to switch these voices. Whale is a hard voice. Uh, it's like... Uh, <laughs> uh, I doubt he ever left saw does. Now he's like a smoker. <laughs> Go see if you can sniff him out. Oh, we need his master woodwork skills. Uh, now I'm gonna go on. Okay. I can't open this yet. Okay, wait, where, where do I go? This way? Okay. A bench! It's all miss... Okay. <laughs> I may need to get some water. But let's uh, try to finish this part first. Beep, 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 boom. How do I get through here? Oh, I would take that. Thank you. I think I gotta go around. Beep, boop, boop, boop. Give me that. Nice. Give me this. Do you want it right now? Well, look at Tony. Okay, um... Hold on one sec. Hold on. Um... Uh, let me get one. One sec. Nothing like cool or crisp water. <laughs> hmm? Ah, sorry. Okay. Woof, woof. I didn't expect a uh, lot of voice acting. <laughs> I didn't expect a big ass story. Well, I mean, you know. Oh god, what should his voice be? I'll just be like, uh, e, Tony, but my god, a bear. It was just me, sir. Hank from the thicket. Oh my goodness, you could talk? <laughs> I'm just shaking the tail, boy. How is your mother? Uh. Uh, she's great. Listen, uh, I just wanted to ask if you could help, with, uh, help us. We've got a... Help? Why did you say so? What do you need? A stack of birch? Well, actually, my friends and I were wondering... An oak spoon? Oh, I think Margaret would love that! <laughs> Grandpa... Grandpa voice. Has anyone taught you how to saw yet? Uh, no, there's this shark in Timber Crossing. Oh, oh! A redwood plaque for your fish? He says he's bringing humans to the valley! Oh. Well. We haven't seen those in a while, have we? <laughs> what could I possibly have to do with that? How much do you know about building things? For humans, I mean. Well. As you know, as you of course know, everything people make is perfect. When I took over the mill here, I found all these papers and skin and screw schematics. <laughs> Felt like I was stumbling upon artifacts. Never thought woodwork could take so many shapes. Look here. 
elaborate contour is not a frame perfect angles. Clearly, only an incredible being could come up with all of this. Well, can you make all that? Oh, anyone can. It's quite simple once you figure out how to read these things. Would you... Would you like me to teach you, young lass? Uh, yes! <laughs> well, I was hoping you could find it, uh, help us fix up this old shack in Timber Crossing. Oh! How wonderful! We might need my back saw and mallet, a ladder, oh, and a couple stacks of pine. Fetch those for me, will you? The bright yellow ones. They're all yellow! Okay, now I gotta collect stuff. Yay! You can split stacks. Cabbage with the main engine. I know how to get things. I know how to pick things up. I know. I'll take all the stuff. I'm good at that. I'm good at taking, stealing. <laughs> I mean, taking. I mean, <laughs> a couch. I'll take a couch. Oh, I'm so excited to make things. To make nice things. Spooky. I guess I can like go to sleep. Man, we kind of just left our mom. And was like, bye mom. I'm gonna go run a business now. And not tell you about it. What is that sound? What was that sound? I don't know. Okay, I don't want to get too far away. There's so much! Uh, so, did you find all the wood? Uh, sure, here you go. Yep, got it right here. Grand. Whoa. Grand, perfect. You're doing such a great job. I don't know if you guys can hear that, but my neighbors are bopping around up there. I saw that they have a cat. They have a cat. It was cute. It was by the window and it was like looking at me and then it like scratched the window like it was trying to play. Oh, it was so cute. I really like walking around in my uh, like neighborhood because there's lots of... Hi, Epic! There's lots of uh, people with their animals. They... Uh, a lot of people weirdly walk their uh, cats. I mean, I guess it's not that weird, but that's very enjoyable. I've gotten to pet uh, some people's cats because they walk them around outside. <laughs> There's this one lady who goes who always goes outside with her dog and her cat. <laughs> but yeah, I've seen a lot of cats. There's this one that's close to my apartment. He is well, like white and black. And he looks like a big doofus. He looks like an old man. You had a friend who walked their cat too? Mm hmm. Uh, thanks. I just picked it off the ground. Amazing. Now, I'm headed to Timber Crossing. I'll see you there. Okay. Mm hmm. -hmm. Okay, let's go back. Quest? Follow the trail. I don't like when it's nighttime. I prefer daytime. I'm more of a daytime person. Whew. Okay, where am I going now? Just follow the trail. Oh, 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 he's there. Hello. Oh, yes, that is wonderful. Oh, I'm gonna use the old chat. I haven't seen a human claim it in years. 
Oh, yes, this will do nicely. Look at the sign of the up. As I was telling your friend here, the woods you... The wood you brought out should you bother be enough. I'll get started on this. First, you have to clean up the shadow of all the garbage. I did. I did that. Didn't I do that? Yeah, I did that already. I'm a one step out of you, Grandpa. Did you clean up the shed? No. <laughs> yes. Yep. Right. Now we'll have to use this old workbench. Well, the what? Well, you can't hammer a nail in air. <laughs> you only need some. <laughs> you only need some place to make it work. Uh, table next to the tree, Hank. Grab some wood and put it back together while I tidy up the place. Oh yeah, it's a time. Okay, reusable objects compare various objects in the world by gathering their required. Yeah, yeah. Brick benches. PP place. Mhm. Mm Repairable objects. Passion. Okay. Passages will be cleared and bridges will be repaired to allow access. Okay. Ah, oh, I don't have that. Well, I should probably do the workbench first. Wait, give me that. Oh. Yay! Now it can be used to build rooms and craft furniture. Oh, 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 oh. No building available in this area? Oh, he has to make this like a building? Did you get the workbench fixed? Like, bring, bring it to you, baby. Like, bring, bring it to you, baby. <laughs> it's good. Enough. Uh huh, thanks. Let's see this man work. Oh. I thought he was gonna go, like, super fast. Excuse me. You have plenty of time to get better. Now humans got over the cold stone floors in Nichi Hay a while ago. They would much rather sleep on a clean, soft, springy surface. Here, this is... Uh, here. This is none of those things, but I will do. Uh, yay. Yay. I make one at the workbench. Ever played Elden Ring? Um, I tried it. I'm very bad at it. It's not really a game for me. Do I have to pay attention to this? Toilet hygiene. Once you're done, exit building. Wait, how do I get into building mode? That's... Oh... Oh... You're addicted to Elden Ring? <laughs> A lot of people are. Um... Oh... Okay. Oh, comfort. Okay, the bedroom can be like that. N never mind. Ugh. How do I stop? Doors, beds. Uh, uh, uh. uh never mind. Crafting? Never mind. How do I save this? Bedroom. Great room? Place a door! I don't have a... Do I have a door? Right there. Ah! Wait, was that a... Is that a door or... At least I tried it. <laughs> okay, let's see. How... Where did I go? Okay, I started. I ran around. Oh yeah, there was a really weird glitch. Um... With the very first boss. Uh, you know how it's like... You're supposed to kind of get donked by it and then it gives could put you down in a hole or something I don't know mine like glitched right away. I, I didn't even get hit by him and then it 
it cutscened or something. I don't know, it was weird. I was like, what the heck? Um, and then I ran around to have more. There was a big field. Lots of guys, you had to sneak around and like kill them. And then I was like, why am I killing these guys? I guess you don't really have to kill anything. I mean, you do, but <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> um, and then I got to the big field where there was a man and he talked to me and I said, hello, man. And he said, you ain't got no maidens. And I was like, that's true. <laughs> And then... What am I doing? Um... And then there was the big, uh, like... Horse man. And I was like, uh-uh-uh. I know your tricks. I'm not gonna go there. So I didn't, because obviously I could not fight him. So... Then... Kept walking. There was a lady- oh. There was a lady who gave me a horse? That was pretty cool. Although the horse was a nightmare to control. I was really bad at that. <laughs> and... Uh, that's when I stopped. I got the horse. I ran around. A big giant man tried to kill me. He, he did. Plenty of times. And I realized you're just supposed to run with the horse. <laughs> And then I got to like this road. That's where I stopped. If that makes any sense to you, good job. Good job for understanding what I was saying. <laughs> Please place a door. Ow. Ow. Add a door. Ow. Why is it like. Uh... You understand? <laughs> Add a window. We'll put a window right there. Uh, crafting items. Crafting recipes. Crafting materials. Okay. I made a room. Why is it all gray? Crafting. Oh, craft the bed. Build room. Ah. Where is my bed? Uh... Oh, okay, we'll put the bed right there. Edit. Oh, Bloop. okay. Nice. How do I get out of here? Excellent. Ah, I did it! Hello. You can make a bad using the workbench. Come when you've got one. But I did it. Did I not do it? Using the workbench, craft a bed. Oh, maybe because I put it down, I craft another one? I did everything. <laughs> uh oh. Okay. I see. Well, I crafted another bed. Where did I make that bed? Yep. Didn't think it could look worse than the schematics. <laughs> nah, it looks fine. But here we are. Oh, I mean, excellent. You're doing well. Better than mine back home. That's just sad. Well, hurry along and put it to good use. Make it better and put a bed in it. Okay, I did that. So to make that bedroom? Yes, yeah, sir. Stains and all. Well, I almost prefer it to the dead tree I used to sleep in. You encourage weird. All right, now this is the most important step. Humans always need to feed their false sense of superiority by having someone around they can look down on. You seem to know a lot about that. So we're gonna give me. We're gonna need to make them feel welcome. By putting down a little table in front of the house. That tells them where to go. And a little black book to keep the records of the shark. Ah, yeah. Here's how you make it. Quite straightforward, will you? Awesome! Thank you! Put it down in the shed and make it time to rake in the dough. 
Okay. I would do that. Craft. Huh? Wait, did they give it to me? Maybe I should read. Placing objects. Um. Uh, well, build one you can always place furniture freely without having to build a room first. Well, I gotta craft the item first, right? No one recipes. Oh! Ah! Okay. Handy. We'll put this... Can I... Uh, oh, right there. there. Okay. There we go. Did you place your point this? Yes. Is there... It looks good. If I didn't know any better, I'd say you're a natural, Hank. That's a fast learner. This is not that great. It took me forever and there's barely anything in there. Are they even gonna like it? Mm, I'm sure. You sure know how to pick a oh, Sorry. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry. I got the sharky boy. Tell him we've got his joint ready. Okay. Beep boop beep boop beep boop 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 boop. Nothing to lose. Nothing to lose. Beep. Hello. We have. Uh, we'd like to have a human dober. Congratulations! Your premium property is now listed on the network! Yay! The time has come to unleash something both intriguing and unfortunate on Silver Valley. People. These dewy, mostly hairless creatures are a controversial topic in the neighborhood. Some thought they were godly beings, forging the world with their magic and machines. Mostly because they left behind food and other stuff that animals liked. Others would throw a fit of rage, calling them unqualified hairbringers of doom. A bit dramatic if you ask Hank. All he knew for sure was that his mom always said, Keep your distance. So much for that. Ooh. Congratulations! Your premium property is now listed on the network. You can now start earning hardly life-changing income. Simply accept your first guest through the, your front desk and give them an experience of a lifetime. Okay. Oh no. Is my desk backwards? I want to fix that. I would like to fix that. How do I rotate? R oh, okay. <laughs> Duh. Okay. Wait. Okay. Guess. Guess management. Overall panel will show all the active res resorts you've discovered. Each resort will display its available bedrooms, guests, requests, and reviews. Bedrooms will bid you listed with their current vaca vacancy status and scores. Every morning, your guests will request to, your request to stay your resorts. New guests will request to stay your resorts at your resorts. Is this a spelling and will? You have to accept them and assign them to rooms. Uh, depending on the resort, each guest will have demands for their room. Use the accept button to accept a guest request. Assign the guests to a bedroom for their stay. Try to match the bedroom. Okay. You can get more guest requests per day in area by repairing monuments. Whoa, look at that. Uh, while you are off on an adventure in another location, your resort will still run. Oh, that's cool. Okay. I should probably fix the outhouse, huh? Leather Lodger's tools. I don't have those. Well, it's just a shack. That's it. That is what it is. All right. Thank you, Shed. How do I request? Oh! 
Hello, Elisha. Elisha Lawton. Lawton. Whatever. <laughs> okay. We got a guest. I think. Meet and greet. Okay, I did it. I did it. I did it. I did it. <laughs> uh, I'm not gonna say that again. There's a human on the way. Congratulations! You are now on your way to financial independence! In actuality, you are much, much closer to financial ruin. But you have a head start! And that probably means something! In any case, make sure you keep up with the guest demands, as they tend to become pickier and pickier. Sadly, an issue that technology hasn't been able to solve yet. Okay, cool. Oh, you have another quest? Oh no, alert! Alert! It looks like your premier property is lacking in the old P department. Hey, I don't. Proceed! Uh, that means that the decorative levels of your property aren't up to our low, low standards. It's ugly! No, just like my room. <laughs> In order to attract more lucrative guests, just make your properties more appealing by adding non essential ornamental furniture and knickknacks. Guests go crazy for knickknacks. What an uncomfortable sentence. Raise the property prestige level to a satisfying degree before returning. Uh, prestige. I understand. Lots of decorations. This is kind of cool. That's nutty, man. I get to make so much stuff. Where's our guest? I guess not here yet. Maybe it'll come tomorrow. Well, how do I build stuff? I ain't got no recipes. Decorative items? I ain't got nothing. Do I talk to somebody? Oh, it's telling me to go this way. What is... Whoa, give me all this junk! Whoa! <gasps> Garbage! Can't open this yet. Excuse me. Oh, there, big fella. Where'd you come from? I live here. Oh, where'd you come from? Alright, enough of the questions. What are you after? This sure sounds like a question. Rat junk muck? I'm looking for something humans like. Something that would make them feel more... Mmm... Distinguished. A slop scrap rubble? No, I, I need something exquisite. Uh, that's where you're wrong, my colossal companion. I got what you need. You stumble upon the most handsome curator of crap this side of the valley. There isn't one thing these animals throw away that I can't flip back at them. Great. Let me just have a look in the dumpster. Not so fast, but so how do I know I can trust you? Oh, my, um... Authoritative height? <laughs> be that as it may, we don't trade with just anyone off the street. My head would be in a gutter before noon. Although I do spend a lot of time down there. But you gotta be proof before I can sell you anything. I'll tell you what, there's a bus depot, 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 across the road. <laughs> I can smell the stinky tuna from here. I need a snack, then we can talk. Okay, snack time. But also, give me this junk. Take, 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 what is this? I can't open this? Well, give me his junk. Okay. Can I go in here? Wow. Pen on a string? 
I... I can take this. Don't tell anybody. <laughs> Save your electricity. What's up? Well, hello there, bud. Aren't you a good looking one? I haven't seen the likes around... You haven't seen your likes around my buses before. I like your hair. You have bear noises. One man's trash is another bear's treasure. Yes. Oh, what kind... What a kind looking bud you are. I'm Oliver. I run the buses here if it wasn't evident. <laughs> Look at me. Of course it's not evident. Bears don't take the bus. <laughs> do you? Do you, do you take the bus? Uh... What's your bus? <laughs> I don't see why you couldn't either. You know what? Do you think you could do me a solid, bud? I got this letter I've been dying to send. But I can't just leave my buses. And there's not been any posts since, well, many years. You probably know these places better than I do. Do you think you could find your way to Sawdust? And give this to Beanie for me? Uh, awesome. She usually hangs around the Firewatch Tower. Okay. Oh man. Too many quests. No, it's fine. <laughs> well, I can't do that yet. Can I, like... Pick my quests? Which one I'm... On the road. Okay. We're doing that one. Okay. Well, where is it taking me? Why did it take me this way? Sleep the night? Oh. Oh, nice. Okay. I like that. I don't think I could handle the bus life. <laughs> the bus life ain't for me. Okay, it's just taking me to the nearest quest. So I have to go closer to the other one, maybe? Oliver also knows the bus driver, the beanie and all this crap. The best way to find out is to make your way to Sawdust and hand it over. Well, where is that? I don't know. Is my guest here? Oh, she is. Uh, she's scared of me. Sorry. Don't be scared. I will make your life better. I do think that's a nice touch. <laughs> I'm a bear and I have an Airbnb for humans. What if I just go this way? Nope, can't go that way. <laughs> well, where the heck am I? Hmm. It's not giving me a tracker for the other quest. Bum, 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 bum. Probably the other way. That's what I'm guessing. This way? Sawdust! Oh, okay. We found it! Drink some water. Ah! Hey. Oh, can't make that yet. Seems like you can like go all around this world. And you're gonna have a bunch of Airbnbs. And they're all run at the same time, give you stuff to make better Airbnbs. It's pretty cool. I like it. It's a mashup of a couple of stuff. But it's pretty original. Pretty original idea. At least, I think so. We gotta find Beanie. <laughs> oh! Hello! Nope, you're not Beanie. Hello! I don't believe in that yet. How did you end up here? 
with my feetsies. <laughs> Good, physical activity is always a great idea. Wait, you can understand me? Well, that, he had a weird accent. <laughs> I've been around these woods for a while. I think I get the gist of what you're saying. Oh, well, yeah, then... What am I saying right now? Actually, it literal bear noises. <laughs> that was pretty unintelligible. I guess... I could use the practice. Now I feel bad. Sorry. <laughs> I'm just yoking ya. I'm just yoking ya. Just yoking ya. What a big softy like you doing all the way over here. I'm looking for a beanie. I have something for her. Oh, that's uh, just a nickname. I'm Beanie. Or say, say, bin, say, bin, say, 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 bin. Hey, Bean. Hey, if you're my mom. <laughs> but I like uh, Beanie. No one calls me that anymore. Who told you that? Oliver, the bus person. He gave me a letter for you. Oh, Ollie. Such a sweetheart. No wonder he trusts you. Let me see it. I can't believe you found it. Oh, you weasel. Where was it? Did he tell you? He's not a weasel. No. I understand the wood jump woods. No, no, he found the last page of our atlas. I made this ages ago. He had barely gotten his driver's license. I had a much smaller hat. <laughs> we mapped out the whole valley. Figured out where to put stations for his buses and everything. Uh, I thought this burned up in a fire. I didn't know there a fire was that big. Listen, I know you came all this way, but can you get this thing back to him? I bet he doesn't even know I have the rest. I got a compass! You can have this. I'll help you find your way back faster. <gasps> nice! Can I have your stuff? I'm gonna take your stuff. What do you have, like a fort here? Whoa! Oh my god, Beanie's really cool. Area map can be accessed through the map button next to the mini map. Oh! Area map shows all the important markers and landmarks. Nice! Whoa, cool house. Can I take your stuff? Got anything for me? For my little bear paws? Just the lamp. I'll turn it off so you can save electricity. How do I get back? Oh, go back this way. <laughs> Beanie got beans! <laughs> well, we should explore this area a little bit since we're here. Oh, I'm guessing she has beans. Who doesn't have beans, am I right? Bee, bee. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Bloop. Man, I just want to collect everything! Already, bud? Did you find Beanie? Did you give her the letter? Uh, she called you a weasel. The sound of a plane. Uh. Oh, you're the man, bud. Or bear, sorry. Oh, what did she say? She gave me this for you. Oh wow! Oh wow! Bud! Draw on the rest of it! That's incredible, bud! Oh, drawing all this out for which her was the most fun I had ever. Should have driven the bus, of course. Of course. Look! There's Sados in high, the High Lake? Look! This is where we are! Oh, you probably don't even know what I'm on about. This valley is huge! There's places the bus couldn't even reach! I know. It's wild! Listen, I've been here for a while. 
Just me and my boss. But it just don't feel right for us to sit on our tires like that, you know? No one's really needed me for my buses in a long time. With all the new folks are in the visit and all. I think you should have this. And look, see where these old bus stops are? You manage to pick these up, like you did with the old storage shed. I'll give you bus rides for free! Oh, Heck, I don't think bears have any pockets for money anyway. Awesome! Okay. Look, the first one is right next to the shed. How about it? You got it, bud. Uh, Alice, the world map can be accessed by clicking on the world map button. World map button? No, okay. Here you can see where Hank is. Excuse me, ma'am. What areas you've discovered? Okay, let's check it out. So this is like a, the map of where we are right now. And then we click on this and we got the whole, whole thing. Well, it's huge. Oh, it looks like there's a lighthouse, big lake, mountain, snowy mountain, forest, uh, dock. Cool. Okay. Now. Oh, uh, I said find a sandwich. I guess I got one. Did that guy give me a sandwich? I don't even know, but here you go. Oh, uh, so did you find any grub? Uh, yeah. Yeah, right here. Feel bread, crunchy cheese, weak old mustard. That's all I could find. <laughs> like mom used to make. Alright, you brutish charmer. I'll you buy my special selection swill. And here, I'll even let you have this one for free. But anything else comes at a price. I don't mean none of that stinky human stuff. Garbage! I mean real valuables. Okay, what do, whoa, what do we got? A welcome mat? I don't know what this costs. Can I take all of it? Okay, I have a cardboard box for some reason. Old drawers? A beer? Small nice sand? How much can I take? Can I take all of it? Wait, the last thing I just picked up was a small night sand. Cupboard? Light? Bear painting? Cute. I'll take two of those. Rug? Lamp? Flowers? Pot plant? And a welcome mat. I'll take another pot plant. Thank you. I so, uh, how come I ain't seen you around here before? Oh, well, you used to come here all the time, dumpster diving. Oh, really? Didn't take you for a criminal. No, no, no it's not like that. My boy will always make me go. And it wasn't only magazines and pamphlets, no bad stuff. Relax, my delinquent friend. I'm not gonna snitch if you ain't. Besides, having a look at new humans around here for a while. Not since the couple that ran around after the big inferno. What? Yeah, we used to never be allowed to pass the fence in the ticket. Now we walk around like we own the place. You never let anyone tell you that you don't. Anyway, you were going back in droves, huh? That's pretty wild if you pull it off. You'll probably make it a few folks pissy in the process. Listen, I got plenty of demand, so my business rolls around supply. No humans, no garbage to sell them back. Especially slim pickets if we don't get any of the original kind. They dumped the best junk! I'll tell you what, since you're picking up the old shed for them, uh, how about you do the same for the kiosk up here? They used to flock around that place like raccoons, all blah 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 blah! <laughs> <laughs> it's me, I'm a raccoons. Uh, I'm just getting the hang of it. This sounds a lot more complicated. Nah! This is one real deal! They just need a couple of things to keep them distracted. The people will know about it. He was here when the place was built. 
Uh, who knows what kind of goods we'll have in the shop? Okay, um... Garbage. 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 Mm, garbage. Hey, sick! New bus station! Yay! Well, I would like to decorate, but also go to sleep. Pen uh, shrink. Can I put that down? No. Old drawers. Put that right there. Small nice sand. Put that right there. A little lamp. A little lamp. A little... Where should I put the lamp? Uh, right there, I guess? I don't know. There's a lamp for her. We got a little bear painting. Nice. Uh, bear painting. A potted plant. Another plant. Cupboard. A mirror. Cover box. Cute. A red. Um. Door right there. Welcome, Matt. Uh, I can't really see it because of the door. Yeah, I'll put it right there. <laughs> I have an old computer. Oh, it's. It's not a real thing. Okay. There we go. Looks great. That looks nice. Sorry. Do I have enough? Oh, I have enough procedure now. Property procedure is the principle of proof of a proof. Wait, okay. Property procedure is the principle proof of a prominent plot. Press the green button. That looks a little better now, I think. Congratulations! You increased your new property value by a quarter of a percent! That is 278%! 278% more than our guests receive on their average trip! More prestige properties will earn better results, so keep up the work! What's next? Congratulations! Oops, I thought they were saying the same thing like they usually do. Now that you're earning the equi equivalent tips of a door-to-door -door salesman, you are presented with an opportunity. In order to achieve the prestigious pawn voyage pedigree, per 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 you have to bring the property in this area up to our standards. Complete this day for two guests in Timber Crossing. Okay, I probably have to make another bedroom then. Maybe like a bedroom like that. <laughs> Let's do that. Like this. Wait, 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 wait. I want to make add tile. Um. Remove time. Why am I holding a door? I don't want to hold a door. I want to... Okay. Well, this kind of stinks. I didn't want it to be like that. Why? Add tile. Alright. Remove time. And then... There we go! That's what I wanted. And I already made a bed! Ha <laughs> ha! Yay! I did it! Ha <laughs> ha! Oh wait, uh... Okay, I think we can have another guest. Nobody wants it. 
guest request? Oh. I like this lady's hat. I like her hat. She looks cool. There you go. Sick, now we have two people. This is nice. See, one can hear. Come on, go over here. This one's a little nicer. You gotta play a little bit more for this one. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Hello. Hello again, my child. I mean, uh, my favorite apprentice. Uh, don't worry. He's been calling me that all day. You get used to it. Uh, well, hello. Look, I have, a, I have a very good authority that the kiosk up there is our next best shot at getting more humans to come. Oh, you did, do you? Oh, what authority is that exactly? Oh, uh, well... Oh, a marvelous steel travel kiosk was a jewel of the timber crossing. It was one of the first things humans built here. Oh, uh, so kind of like the pyramids. <laughs> no. You'll actually find it more of a rectangular... A rectangular what? So I think we should spruce it up like we did with the shed. And now attract more humans to get us even more money, right, Will? Right. Don't know how he came up with that. Oh, it's a brilliant idea. Sonny. Student. Yes, that's what I said. I take it back. You don't actually get used to it. Well, let's get started right away. Go in there and clear the building out of the rubble and get the building. Go through the building, building, the building. Building, building? Where's the building? This way? No, this man wants to talk to me? Oh, hello. Did you buzz about something fixed? Yes, I did. Oh, blah, blah, blah. That's great news! Oh, Oliver seemed like a friendly, easygoing softy. One of the few people that stick around the valley. Took, on the other hand, was a crooked critter with a taste for stolen baloney. A strange pair that lived in particular harmony. Uh, I guess now that guys only burned through my nose hairs already! Listen. Anytime you come across one of these stuffs, just give it a wash. Slap a new sign on it. Oliver's toolbox. And boom, I'll drive you there anytime. Thank you. Bus stations, repair bus station, fast travel. Mm. Okay, cool. Cool beans. Oh, this is like his shop. And I can buy these to repair. Oh, I need that. Give me that. Okay. Let's make our outhouse pretty. Whee! There it is. Yay! Luxurious facilities for the unassuming. Definitely an attractive proposal for anyone in an emergency. I have one extra guest per day in this area. I kind of wish I would know, like... Um, if the guests are here or not, how many guests we have? I'm sure there's a way to... I'm sure they told me. Um, I don't know. I feel like they told me, but... Oh, clean? Um, yes. Oh, my sparkling. Wonderful. Uh, from everything correctly, right there's a few things a few would look for in the kiosk. I can make a couple, but I don't have everything I need to get them just right. There's a few oddities I need to get it all together. I need a bit of human literature. Well, I've got a book back home with games. I saw some old computer sitting under the tower inside us. Some sort of writing apparatus. Oh, I have it. I have it. I did it. I have it. Don't I? Oh, a book on spelling. Oh, I thought they were talking about the... On the thicket. Ooh, back to my mom. Bum, 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 bum. 
complete this stay for your two guests in timber. I thought I did that. Aren't they? Are they not coming? Bedrooms. There. Oh, arrives tomorrow. Oh. Can I go to sleep yet? Maybe I should wait. Go to sleep. Take a drink. Time. Oh, you can see different stuff on the ground. That's kind of cool. Exit area, exit area. You can, you can at least see where wood is, I guess. It's kind of weird. I don't want to walk around at night. Let me sleep. I don't know. Isn't it nighttime? Where's the little thingy that tells me if it's nighttime? Usually these kind of games have like a little tracker of it is nighttime, it is daytime. I guess this game isn't really dependent on time because you don't have to sleep. So it doesn't really need that, you know? That always kind of bothered me in games. I never liked the time limit. I guess my biggest gripe, like, like it makes me think of Stardew Valley, right? Like a time limit. You're going through cycles of days and years and months or whatever. And uh, I don't like that. A lot of there's there's a couple like uh, person like scenes with people that you can unlock, but you have to do them at certain times. And you would only know to do that if you looked it up or played it more than once, I guess. Which isn't a problem. It's just kind of like... Do I have to restart my whole game? <laughs> because I didn't get that one scene? That sucks. I would like to get that scene. I want to see that scene. You know what I mean? But I guess it makes it have a bit more of like... Replayability. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Or there's the time where, like, uh, Animal Crossing. Maybe I just can't sleep while I'm on this quest. I don't know. Um, like in Animal Crossing, you know, it's it's uh, it's a real life clock, which is nice and not nice. <laughs> Can I fix this? Yay! Nice. Bus station. Oh, I don't know how to get back to the. I don't know how to get back to home. I don't know where that is. I go back. Oof. You know, I think this might be a good point to stop for now. Mm-hmm. Ooh. Ooh. Man, this is this is a good game though. I'm having fun playing it. Mm-hmm. It is definitely one of those games I feel like you kinda have to I don't know. You just play it for hours and do your little tasks. You know what I mean? It's not bad or anything. <laughs> It's good though. Yeah, I'm gonna click off of it. Okay. It's a good game. Um, let me know if you guys want to see me play more or not. I don't know. Let me know. Um, yeah, it's a good game. <laughs> I really love the style of it and the characters and everything. 
it looks really good. I love the way it looks. The, like I said before, like the way it looks makes me, um, I don't know. It makes me want to like make a video game myself. <laughs> An impossible task. But it's like, man, I wish I could make something like that, you know? <laughs> yeah, it looks cute. It does. And I don't know if you guys have seen it. I would recommend looking up like the trailer for this game like the animation that they did was really good it's really amazing i i recommend a little look at the trailer because the animation was so cool <laughs> mm -hmm. nice little game nice little task game i like it mm -hmm. um let's see sunday sunday i'm gonna be playing uh stray be playing that at around two o'clock on Sunday, so that'll be the next stream. Look out for it. Keep your eyes peeled. <laughs> but thanks for coming. Thanks for watching. Thanks for bearing along. Thanks for being a bear, friend. <laughs> you know what I mean. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Have a good rest of your night. Uh, see you later, alligator. Goodbye.